Wilton is well known for its quality bakeware and amazing recipes. They are dessert experts and their products can be found in stores all over. There's no doubt that the Wilton buttercream frosting recipe will satisfy your sweet cravings. American buttercream is one of the most commonly used frostings. It is simple to make, has a great taste, and pairs well with many different desserts. It is also easy to work with, making it a great choice if you are planning to decorate. This delicious recipe is a popular choice amongst cake lovers for buttercream frosting. It is an easy recipe and requires no baking experience. This is certainly a recipe you want to add to your collection. Wilton Buttercream Frosting, a versatile frosting. This classic frosting is a top choice for bakers. It is easy to work with, which makes it great for decorating shapes and piping designs. It also pairs well with several different desserts. This buttercream is a great frosting to make if you are a beginner baker, as it is simple to prepare. Its creamy texture and rich taste will leave you wanting more. What you will need for this Wilton buttercream frosting recipe. Ingredients. Half cup solid vegetable shortening. Half cup butter or margarine. For cups sifted confectioner's sugar. Two tablespoons milk. One teaspoon vanilla extract. Step-by-step -step instructions. Step one. In a large bowl, Beat the shortening and butter together with an electric mixer. Mix until light and fluffy, and then beat in the vanilla extract. Step 2. One cup at a time, gradually add in the sugar and beat on medium speed. You will need to scrape the sides and bottom of the bowl often. Once mixed, the frosting will appear dry. Step 3. Gradually add the milk and beat on medium until the frosting becomes light and fluffy. This frosting recipe is for a stiff consistency buttercream, which is great for piping decorations. For a thinner consistency, which is ideal for frosting cakes, you can add one teaspoon of water, milk, or corn syrup for every cup of frosting. This buttercream frosting comes out white, so you can add food coloring to achieve your desired shade. Wilton's gel-based food coloring works great with buttercream frosting, as it won't change the texture, but provides vibrant color. Tips and tricks. If you are using a hand mixer instead of a stand mixer, beat the shortening, butter, vanilla, and milk first. Then once all those ingredients are mixed, gradually add the sugar. To avoid the frosting from curdling, make sure the ingredients are room temperature before making your frosting. Cold butter is the main reason frosting curdles, as the temperature changes the consistency. If you live in a humid climate, you may add a teaspoon of sugar at a time if your frosting is too wet. Suppose that your frosting is too dry, add up to half a teaspoon at a time of water, milk, or corn syrup. If you are wanting a creamier buttercream, you can make this recipe with all butter, subsisting out the vegetable shortening. Replace the half cup of shortening with an additional half cup of butter. This will make a softer buttercream. However, it will be more prone to melting in warm temperatures. If you find this buttercream too sweet, you can add a pinch of salt when adding the liquids to the frosting. You may also add a splash of lemon juice to balance out the sweetness. This buttercream can be left for up to three days at room temperature. It can be stored in the fridge for up to two weeks and in the freezer for up to six months. Make sure to thaw leftover buttercream before decorating with it. Otherwise, the cold buttercream will not hold its form. After storing buttercream in the fridge or freezer, make sure to whip it back together once it has thawed. Buttercream often separates when it is stored in the fridge or freezer. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.